Okay, hold on, guys. All right. Got to fix my headband. All right. All right. Sorry, I look I look a mess right now. Uh, I just got back from captain's practice at the high school I'm going to. I'm signing up for dance team. Cross your fingers for me. All right. Anyway. Yeah, I look a mess with my my, <laughs> my tights on, <laughs> like, every day. All right. But I'm going to do the beginning of the Mrs. Wright. I'm going to do a tutorial to the beginning of Mrs. Wright. Um, okay, so first. The first move in the be in Mrs. Wright dance is the pretty boy. If you don't. Okay. So... You're going to, you go to the right first. So you're going to cross your right foot back and put your hand up, slide across your head, down. So it's one, two, down. Then same with the other hand. You're going to put, your, this is your left hand, you're going to put your left foot back and do the same thing down. So, one, two, down. Okay. So I'm gonna do both of them and I'm gonna go slow. Right? So where's Mrs. Wright? Well we can let the choir out Yeah. Okay, so Okay. So, for the, I gotta see her. It's, I gotta see her travel all across the world. Put your right foot back and turn. Just bot, downward body roll. Then roll your arm. Meet me on the light. You're gonna, put, okay. You're gonna put your hands like this up, meet me on the flight, down. Then you're gonna put your left leg up and put it to the side. You're gonna put your left leg, put it to the side, right leg to the side, down. One, two, three, four. All right. So I'm gonna start from the beginning. And I'm just going to talk it out, all right? Where is Mrs. Wright? I got to see her travel all across the world. Travel all across the world. Just to meet her. Put your right foot back and then turn. So right foot back, turn. Just to meet her, Pete and flight. One, two, down. Then, kind of move it out. Alright, so now I'm going to do it faster. I'm going to take off this headband because it keeps falling off and it's bothering me. Alright. Yeah, my, my room is a little junky. But, um, <laughs> alright, ready? Five, six, one, two, three. Five, six, seven, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then I know five usually does that on eight. So you can do that or you can just put your arms down and blaze if you don't know what in blaze means. And blaze is straight hands. Down. Excuse that. Uh, if you've ever danced like professionally, you know that you always want to end in blaze, and blaze, and blaze, and blaze. You always want to end in blaze. So, yeah. Travel, travel to LA, maybe to the Bay. From the Shy Town. 
I know I had a problem with Star Town in the beginning because it's it's one of those moves that it's not really difficult, but if you don't have like a rhythm mindset in your head, or if you don't have like the thought process of oh, it's just moving your feet and then moving your shoulders at the same time, then you're gonna overthink it and you're gonna be like, I can't get this. But then when you're not trying your hardest, that's when you get it. And you're like, oh, it's not that difficult. Why was I overthinking it? Duh. And then, I mean, yeah. So, okay. Maybe in LA, maybe to the bay from the shy town. Straight. But she might be out the state. Book a flight to London. Travel to LA. Okay, so when you when you hear travel to LA in the song, you're gonna do travel to LA. So you're gonna put your hands out. Hands out. You can close your fist or you can be in blade, doesn't matter. And blades means straight fingers, thumb in. Uh, fist is making an E. This is in blaze. This is fist. In blaze. In blaze. Fist. In blaze. Fist. All right. If you see the E, then you're doing it right. Yeah. As you can see, all my muscles and my arms are engaged. Um. But you can do L A. So it'll be L A down, up, down, up. Maybe. So you're kind of just rolling your arm. Just maybe. Maybe. And you're you're gonna put your. It's almost like a gangsta lean, if you know, you know, just a gangsta lean. But you're gonna kind of get on the balls of your toes. And yeah, just maybe, maybe, maybe the bay. So two of those, and then from the shy town. If you think about it as kind of like a mashed potato, here I'll move the computer. If you think of it as kind of like a mashed potato. In a way, you have your hands on your hip, and then you're going to put your leg, you're going to put your leg, okay, you're going to put your leg like this, but, so, one, two, back leg, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Alright, ready? So I'm gonna do this. One, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Just do that a couple of times, because I know that it's kind of a difficult to step to get at first. So after you got it, then you do one, two, and you just move your shoulders with it. You can roll your shoulders like that, or you can do up and down. Um, I actually, for me, I know it's easier for me to get the step when I roll my shoulders. Because it makes me think about, okay, so you have to roll, roll your leg in, then out. Then roll your leg in, then out. Then kind of get that motion. So after you practice that, ooh, after you practice that step a few times, you can put your hands on your hip and you can do it.
So, from the shy town. And as right after you finished your back leg twisting one time, then you go down, like straight down, like military sergeant down. And from the shy town, yeah, down. And then you really want to go hard for this dance. Because if you're practicing it, I mean, I understand marking it a couple of times before you start actually getting into the dance. But if you don't practice it with, like, confidence, that's the word. If you don't practice it with confidence, then it's going to look weak. It's gonna, not going to look swagged out. And you're going to be like, oh, it doesn't look like MBs. And then you're going to feel all bad. So just kind of like... Don't, don't let yourself get discouraged. I know when I first started dancing point blank period and I started learning dances and stuff, like palm, like today, I learned a palm dance. Palm dance, P-O-M, palm, um, is basically just like cheerleading, really strong, really strong, stuff like that. So, yeah, but I'm going to move on. I'm going to do it fast one time. I can see if I can do it. Okay, so after you do Shy Town, you're down here, right? You're down. Like this. And then you're going to do, you're going to twist your body. If you've ever seen the girls talking about video when they twist their body. Sorry, I'm watching Sister Act and that's my movie. But um, when you twist your body, you just... Okay, so you're straight up like this. Muscle man. Alright? Muscle man. Look at your... But you're gonna... You're gonna have... Twist. Down. Twist. Down. Right? Okay. Okay. Alright. From the shy town. The other state. Book of flight to London. Alright, then you're gonna do like Princeton's groove. You know that uh, Princeton and Prodigy's groove, you know, little, yeah, all of them groove. They actually all do pretty well. But um, you're gonna you're gonna do that, but it's gonna be a little different. So da da. From the shy town, if you might be out the states, da da. Book of flight to London, book of flight to France, then we go to Switzerland, then we hit Japan. And I gotta go, cause I gotta go to my next dance lesson, but I'll, I'll do a better tutorial, maybe at dance, if I can get in the studio after class then I'll get, do one in my friend from record and we'll do one together all right okay yeah so I'll do I'll try and see if I can do it again later I'm gonna put my headband back on I'm coming um, I'm gonna put my headband back on and I'll see you guys later bye oh follow me and Follow me on Instagram and Twitter. Yeah. If you want to. And it's going to be down there. Down there.